want the best controller customizations around, then head over to Angel Grips, use my code GOON, it will get you 5% off. What's up guys, Guinness to here bringing you an inform player review and today it is second inform Luis Suarez, the Uruguayan forward who plays for Barcelona. So let's look at the team that I played him in alongside 97 rated record breaker Ronaldo. Remember guys, 300 likes would be amazing, make sure you follow me on Twitter as well. So looking at him, he's 5 foot 11, high attacking, medium defensive work rate, right footed, 4 star weak foot and 4 star skills, cost me just over 3 million. 11 games, 8 goals and 5 assists is what he brought to the table and I've also added the dead eye chemistry style to him as well. How does he compare to his regular card? Well his pace has gone up by 4, dribbling and passing both by 7 and then shooting, defending and physical have all gone up by 8 overall. So it is a massive increase, this is his 4th special card that he's had and this is reflected in the in-game stats. What you'll see is lots of dark green, attack and position, acceleration, agility sprint speed reactions strength as well as in the dark green that is what you want look at that he's maxed out in terms of physical pace shooting dribbling and almost passing as well so it's absolutely outstanding same with the skill attributes lots of green and dark green on there as well which is what you want especially shot power long shots that is what you want from a striker or a forward player but he's 178 pounds can play as a striker or as a center forward as well so he is versatile and then in terms of specialities and traits it's just the same as the second man of the match no changes there so what are my expectations of this card? Well, I was hoping for something special, seeing that it is his fourth special card that he's had. This is his second in form, but he's also had two Man of the Match cards as well. So he's had a fantastic season, and he may be getting a team in the season as well, seeing how his season's going. So what did I like about this card? Well, this card's got fantastic pace. It's fantastic in terms of it is a complete forward. He can do everything well. He's strong enough to hold the ball up. He can finish absolutely amazing. Put him on your free kicks, he won't disappoint. He's got fantastic movement as well. Fantastic in the air as well. We'll get your headers just like he did there. You can pretty much do it all. Fantastic range of passing as well. Throwing four star skills and a four star weak foot as well. And a nice pace upgrade on this card compared to his regular card as well. It's a fantastic card to use. It is overshadowed this week due to the fact that he's impacts with record breaker Ronaldo. But this card is good enough to be the highlight of a team of the week. Normally, this would be an outstanding card to have in a team of the week if it wasn't for Ronaldo being in there as well. Is it worth the coins? Well, at the moment, he's going to be super cheap because of the fact that everyone's opening packs to get that Ronaldo and also see the man of the match Messi that came out last night as well. So his price is going to drop and I can see his price range dropping. So I'd wait for his price to drop if you're going to get hold of him. But he's an outstanding card in his own right. Would definitely recommend him to you. Although he is very similar to his second man of the match, but is a tiny bit better. You do notice it when you play with him. So that's the advice with him, but still a fantastic card to use. So if you ever what I thought about him, great pace. Fantastic finishing and long shots as well. His dribbling is absolutely amazing. Passing's right up there. Put him on your free kicks as well. And then four stars on the weak foot and the skills as well. The only thing I don't like about him is the meaning defensive work rate. It's probably better suited to centre forward, I would say, if you do get hold of him. But still does a fantastic job at striker. So overall, I give him a 9.5 out of 10. Hopefully you enjoyed this review. If you did, leave a like below, comment, subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.